Okay, so the enclosures are ready, and the first one we're going to transfer is this Pekin Cerdes, the Haitian brand. Okay, here goes. Yeah, wasn't too bad. So yeah, it's definitely got plenty of space in there, and it should be a while before it needs upgrading. Anyway, let's uh, go on to the next one. Next up, we have the pair of tiger beetles. I think that one is the female with the rounded thorax, and that's the male with the uh, more square shaped thorax. And these guys are going to be good in this enclosure with a cork bark hide and just another piece of cork bark for them to climb over as well. And then just a small water dish for them to drink out of. Kind of used a bit of dry sphagnum moss to mix in with the substrate just to give it a more natural appearance. So yeah, let's uh, get them in there. Hopefully these guys are just going to walk straight in for me when I tip the container. There we go. Let's get the other one to uh, go as well. Looks like it's not so keen on the idea. Let's just give it a helping hand. There we go. Yeah, hopefully they'll like it in there. And I'll do an update in a few days. Next up, we have the Ambal Fori. Actually, already got her into the enclosure. She's being a little bit defensive, but that's to be expected from a baboon species. But yeah, this is, this is the enclosure. A piece of cork bark that's been made into a hide, so I'm sure she'll head down there and uh, make a burrow. Yeah, it looks like she's uh, actually climbing out herself. Amazing blue on the legs. Yeah, I need to get the lid on pretty sharpish because uh, I don't want us to make a break for it. And the last spider to get transferred is the adult female Theraphosis sturmi, the Burgundy Goliath. She's got a nice big enclosure with a massive hide. And I decided to put the T-Rex skull in there as well for decoration. And of course she's got a water dish and a couple of fake plants. So yeah, hopefully she'll like it. Let's uh, get her in there. Fingers crossed, should be able to just tip the container and she'll walk straight out. Decided to actually hold on to the uh, tissue paper there. Didn't want to have to do this, but I'm gonna have to give her a helping hand, which means we may get heard. So, uh, things crushes in a good mood. So far, so good. Let's see if she'll walk out now. There we go. Right then. I'm sure she'll enjoy it in there. Very large female. Be a similar size to Charlotte. So yeah, I hope you've enjoyed watching guys. And I'm gonna get the lid on now just in case she decides to wander out. So yeah, thanks for watching and I shall see you again soon.